Elder Silence Cure DM6 Elder. Prepare to fight. Alright, so match number one. Three, two, one. Claws evil. Looks like we'll get evil off the spawn. Dancing with Angel, right? exposing himself over and over again. He actually doesn't have the lead stack wise, so he's probably just gonna, gonna go get his yellows again, take a pot shot at red. He's gonna be real early if he sits around for this. Oh, that's such good dodging. Cockroach mode engaged. So I guess Noctis is with Faz. Okay, that makes sense. Uh, and there's first one minute in. I think you're probably right. This is probably one of Claus's best chances. Evil trying to do the silent no damage drop. Fails it twice. You actually hit the little lip there at the bottom. You don't make any sound. Don't take any damage. Oh, I have 125 FPS starts in. I'm also making... Everyone know that the rail is soon. Thanks for the heads up. Not where Claus wants to be right now. It was a little too early here. It gets knocked off even. Crated. It's just more control for evil. Items are getting synced up a little bit. So since Claus is out of control, he might be able to see one of these Megas away in the next rotation. Or Reds. Either that happens or this gets really ugly really fast. Alright, so does just that. Steals it away. You can get, no, get out of there. Go get your yellow, bro. You need to stack up. Yeah, you didn't miss much, Wim. How you doing? You just, just missed two minutes. It actually started kind of on time. I'm impressed. So this one was definitely Claw's pick. Evil must have picked Silence. Hmm. I don't know, I'm trying to think of what the way the maps are. Sinister Silence, Cure, DM6, Elder. I'm trying to think if there's actually anything in there besides this map that I'd give Claws a slight edge on. It's even so hard to say that Claws has an edge on uh, Sinister. Just because Evil's really good here as well. It's been said before, it's really hard to find a map weakness for a player like Eel. Top players in general. Does actually lose Mega to Claws. And Claws should be able to get himself over to red. It looks like Eel's listening out, yeah. He gets the timing on that. We've been on Evil Cam for a while. Claws has some control, we'll switch over to him.
he will not doing anything stupid or crazy. Didn't show himself anywhere near those items, because it's just a, it's just a major risk. Despite his amazing combat skills, like it's just a huge risk to do. He does get both yellows because of the fact that Claus had to take some time working his way around and making sure that Evil wasn't going to try to steal either of uh, the red or the mega. <laughs> IOU one girl says, "Hey guys, double three zeros incoming." Yeah, I predicted this one to be a three zero. That is a disgustingly unfortunate nerd to eat as well. Um, but yeah, I think this one's gonna be three zero. I think the Trino Cipher might be three one. Oh, cockroach prevails again. He bears his fangs. That's, that's not good. <laughs> a little slap, slappy LG from evil, you don't see that a lot. Uh, don't remember the maps for the group stage name. Game of Neutrino and Cypher, because I was streaming somebody else in that group. So I didn't actually watch it. I just know it was like a big upset or something. There you go. Now, these item timers are gonna be nice because he can get at least two rotations without too much interference. Kinda waste a little bit of time rocking jumping up looking for that shot. But it looks like he you yeah, know he wanted to go in for that kill there. But Rocket's too good. This, this is what I mean, like he took took a little bit too much time going and getting that one. And that's just gonna be a synced up red and mega now. Not the end of the world for him, obviously, but he just you know he needs three frags, his opponent's trying to evade him when you're trying to when you're trying to catch an evading opponent, sticking around and grabbing major items is not like where you wanna be to get kills. Oh, so, so punishing. Might even get killed here, yep. Right off the teleporter. Hey, what's up, Chomp Stomp? This is actually, um, despite... Despite me sounding like, oh, it's gonna be a 3-0 in the best of five. This is actually finals, though. For 125 FPS. And it is, uh, European. You haven't played in 15 years, wow. Welcome back, sir. <laughs> what is this exchange? Neither player wanting to commit to that fight. Or to commit to that rat, I should say. Yeah, I mean, technically, these are... Okay, yeah, this is finals day, but it is... It is combined. Semi-finals. We'll have two best of fives. This is our first one. The winners of both will then go on to play in the grand finals. Oh my gosh. These vertical shots. He lives in the vertical. These are, these are great moves that Closet is doing, and they would work against 90% of opponents. He's only got 40 seconds, he has 4 kills to tie it up. Um, an all but impossible task against Evil. Who is in, he's in that 10%, he's probably, in, to be honest, Evil's in the 2%. He did, he did indeed take second place at QuakeCon this year. And has won numerous, numerous 125 FPS leagues. Preemptive GG comes out. 
forcing Claus to forfeit his game, getting in his head just a little bit. So we'll have Silence up next, followed by Cure. So we'll see at least Silence and Cure after this. Fade Core. The real question is how many minutes of evil in Cypher are we going to see today? It's messed up, yo. <laughs> you say are you saying there's gonna be rage today? Vote now. Predicting Cypher Rage. I owe you one girl thinking it's gonna be over quick. Vote I mean cast. honestly, like with okay. With Agent not performing as well as he should have against Claus and dropping his quarterfinals game, I'm happy that Claus went through, but I'm also a bit disappointed because I feel like Agent is one of those players who can upset either Evil and or Cypher a little easier than Claus can. And then with base going a full five maps and just not being able to clutch it out against Evil in his quarterfinal game, it's almost inevitable that we get the classic Evil Cypher Grand Finals Three, now at this point. Two, no. one. Just unfortunate. Just just blame the quarterfinals. Oh, wow. Almost gets him down with just the machine gun. I'm gonna switch over to Claus as he's gonna get his rail first. Oh no, evil going in for that rail is gonna mean he knows that the yellow wasn't taken. Claus, it all backfired, bro. You just lost all the armor on the map. This should only be a matter of time before he's dead, yeah. And I actually, I'm gonna switch over to him. I'm gonna take Follow Killer off. I wanna watch Claus for a bit, see how he handles this. He's going up against one of the best silence players ever. Not in terms of the fact that he can play items like a boss and sit at the agent green all day long and just do amazing things, but just because Evil hits his freaking shots on this map. No ammo, that's 3-0 early. It's pressured again. And yeah, we may, I mean, we may as well go over to the guy who's hitting the shots right now. It's, it's no fault of clauses. It's just kind of the way this map can run when you lose the whole map like that. This map can be played really slow. I shouldn't say really slow, but this map can be played at a slower pace than it appears at first. But the problem is, is you have to split the map up. And you, have to, you have to draw the line in the sand, so to speak. That invisible line of, I'm over here and you're over here and we're not going to pass each other until there's a major item coming up. And Claus did not draw that line because he did not take the yellow right away. Fifty shafts, pretty good. Make it a mutual. I'll make it a mutual. If he knows mega timing, this might be decent. I'll make us. He could be in sat on with plasma grenade. Can't really push into that. Oh, of course, absolutely. When. Uh, we have a little bit of lag, it looks like, from Claus. He was spiking earlier. But no, absolutely, Wim. Base was more game for Evil. Like, a better a better opponent for Evil. That's why I'm so disappointed that Base didn't actually win. Because if Base wins, then 
this would be a base versus claws game or a base versus agent game in which case base can come out on top of that and then yeah neutrino still would have to beat cypher or Kilson would have had to have beaten neutrino and you know things would have turned out differently but we got what we got three two one It gets the kill now. That's this is this is good. Making sure he's not gonna do anything sneaky, trying to deny anything. Was really just needs to make sure that he uses his weapon advantage right now. Kind of took a little, little too long getting the red, but he needed it. Ooh. Pixel rails for sure. There it is. So now for the spawn, his opponent will get red. Oh, but the shot is good. He saves it. Nice. Not quite the amazing one-two punish on the last yellow, but a punish nonetheless. And a two-point game. He forgot to turn his aimbot on. <laughs> Always important to turn your aimbot on in Quake Live and then not to take. Oh, buddy. Whew. Forgot to breathe there for a second. <clears throat> Is Evil really gonna steal this? What? And he's gonna make it work, isn't he? What a jerk. What a jerk. Evil not actually a jerk, by the way, just in this particular scenario. I can't believe he got away with that. That's right. Shoot yourself in the foot. There we go. Eight to eight. Four minutes. There is extremely contested control on the map. I wouldn't really say either players had control. They're just both hitting really, really heavy shots against each other, so the stacks have been pretty low. This won't be a clean red either way for either player. Nice. That's a great punish. Loses the red, but it's okay. Great, great punish. No 50 bubble up for him? Is it 25 there? Nice. That'll be good enough to fight for this next item. Ooh. Count as lucky stars. Pretty nasty stack on evil here for Claus to work with. The shots are good though. Does gift his opponent the rail, and, and Claus knows that both majors are coming, so he really wants to go get this rail gun. But it's gonna mean he loses Mega and Red, most likely. What's up, Racist Parrot? How is Claus holding up? Just open your eyes, sir. He's don't. He just had us tied up. This is a uh, map number two, by the way. Evil up a map. Probably more like what you meant, what the map score was. So. All this unreturned shaft is just gonna dwindle him down little by little. They both know everything's up on the map. Claws just goes for it. How much armor you got left off of that? After that rail shot, none.
He can do something at this red. This is a big possibility, but kind of kind of fumbles up his jumps. And now he's just eating a little free damage. No, free damage is bad for you, sir. Well, if you're the one getting the free damage, it's a different story, but you don't give up free damage. Nibble is way too quick through these teleporters. Back over to his red. Not gonna even try to bait this one out. He's got a minute 20 to hold this lead. Claus just goes ham into his face. <laughs> Some of these fights that these players have been forcing upon one another have just been a little goofy. Very unorthodox, that's for sure. One minute warning. There's one shot. Gonna take two to kill him. There's two. And the third. Nice. Do we, does he does he need it? Does he need it? Kill right now, no, it's GG. I guess now it's technically GG. You could have tied it if, if you're unfamiliar. If you just came back, and it looks like we actually had a few people who like came back into Quake today, which is awesome. Uh, but if you delay your spawn, when you get killed, you can tap the fire button, and you can instantly spawn, or you can just sit there and wait for the game to spawn you. It takes five seconds. So with three frags down, 15 seconds left was no time. I did play it earlier, I owe you one girl, but I didn't I don't think I was playing it directly for claws. I was just kind of generally playing it for all the players today. <laughs> Evil got too much of it, apparently. I mean and, and this is this is the thing, like it's such a hard it's such a hard call, as I think we're gonna go into cure, right? Yeah, cure. It's such a hard call to say, okay, I'm okay with Claws beating evil, because that would be amazing, it would just be a huge upset in general. Vote now. Vote past. But then, here's the problem. Then you have a Claws Cypher Grand Final, most likely. Like, unless both semifinals get upset, if Claws wins the next three maps and beats evil here, like I said, I'll eat my foot, I already said it, and I'll eat the other one if Fishman will beat Cypher. But then you're, then you're stuck with this weird, kind of awkward grand finals that might not be that good because you have like a really, really good player and like a huge underdog. So I don't know, that's just that's just my take on it. Like I, I'm sure somebody disagrees with me. But that's just what I think. Like, do you really want to have anything other than a Neutrino Claws final or an Evil Cypher final? It's either they both upset or neither of them do, you know? Such commitment, such confidence in his draft today. He's been out practicing all night with the ladies. Oh yeah. Oh, again? Even backing up onto the bubble. Seven points of health left. Picks it up. He's got his green. He's got his mega. He's in time for red. This is a fantastic opening for evil. Not so much for this little fella. Okay. Okay. Sorry I called you little. My apologies. <laughs> Are we really gonna do this? <laughs> In the first got kill of the finals, we'll go to Claws. The first plasma kill of the finals, we'll go to Evil with again 7 points of health before picking up the health bubble. Claus does claim red, Evil works his way over to yellow. He's already got better weapons than Claus does. Still no LG for the Belarusian. It's 
Claw's getting last red is going to know what it is. He's going to assume Mega's soon because he did die on it just before it spawned. And Evil just reading him like a freaking book. What a defense. Like, he, he knew exactly where Claw's was going to be coming in for the attack. Well placed rocket's going to bounce him right off. It's up, Death Accelerator. Yeah, no weapon switch, just a straight gaunt. <laughs> It was a gentleman's gaunt fight too, you know? Oh, good damage. Underdog ties us up for the four, two minutes and 40 seconds in. Nice. Double back in for this shot. Evil not even gonna go for the jump. Alright. I like this rotation here for the player with this control. This is a this is a really nice rotation for him to have. Cause he's not not just getting the red for free because his opponent's getting the yellow, but he's getting one of the greens and some of the shards, which is gonna mean that he's not gonna have to worry too much about dealing with an opponent who's just roaching themselves up. A roaching being like going around just collecting what you can. Stack wise. Oh my god, this is the second time he's caught evil out like that with a shaft. 45 shaft, pretty good. 62 machine gun, pretty good. And it's just going up, man. Claus was out tonight, practicing with the ladies as well. You want me to turn on the lead tide voiceover? The reason I don't do it is I'm gonna forget to turn it back off and it'll drive me freaking crazy the next time I play TDM or watch TDM. Oh, the rocket jump. Oh no. Get away, get away. Nice, evades both rails. Unbelievable. Well, it goes for the second shot, but he can't hit it. Yeah, evil up 2-0. What's up, Kako? I guess if I can... I turned it on for you, Mage. Now, oh, Claus, you've got a rocket launcher. What are you doing here? You gonna get this kill? <laughs> no way. Claus taking a book out of Evil's page. I know, I say that wrong every time, and I just, in the middle of it, I'm not even going to correct myself anymore. We're just, we're just going to take books out of pages all day long, Flare TV style. The page of evil is just to show no respect to your opponent, and just, just do a bunch of damage to them, and do things that are completely unorthodox, and should never work, and are not safe. Claw's doing just that. Because sometimes you just gotta do it. Sometimes it works. Claus wins position on the red, just barely. Shows up a second late, he doesn't get that. Oh, but position on the red doesn't mean you take a bunch of damage onto it, it means you fight for it properly to push your opponent away before taking it. That 50 bubble's gone. 
Somehow, Evil just found himself into a stack of damage. Get a catchphrase. You make it like women, like Winamp, you know? Really kicks the llama's ass. Really takes the book out of the page. Or TV. Crubble, crippling, this is a tie. The lead is tied, Dr. Gar. Thank you for finally informing us that. I don't know where you've been. Question, will we see a map? Number four here. Evil wins, that's a no. Claus has been getting a lot of mega. I'm actually really curious what his pickups are on megas. Oh, only seven to four. I thought it felt like he was getting a lot more megas than that. No I owe you one girl. I, I'm sorry I will not put on the Damia voiceover, the female voiceover. Because when there's an impressive, it sounds like she's about this thrilled. Two frags in two seconds. Excellent. She has no feeling behind her. Oh! Wow. That was, again... Taking the book out of the page. <laughs> Kinda getting used to it. One minute warning. Book out of the page, he's got literally no respect for evil. That's I think maybe that's the secret to playing evil. Is you either have to have just like mad mental slope formulas and maths going on in your head and know that you have a sixty percent chance of going here and a forty percent chance if you go here, and like that's the wrath away to be evil, it's just outthink him. You know, and respect his aim a little bit. I think there is another way to be evil, and that's just to do the same thing that he does and not show respect to his opponents. <laughs> and just fast forward them. It also helps to have the reactions of an 18 year old, aka Claus, who is 9 6. That is a first map for the Belarusian. We go on to map 4. DM6 Campgrounds. Alright. Okay, so so at least you're not you're not completely oblivious to the fact that the Damia voiceover totally sounds vote like now. this. Vote passed. Vote passed. Vote now. Prepare to fight. Should really just that that voiceover just oh. I don't know. This is the new voiceover now, Fade Core, but there's a few of them. Do you like the Damia one, really? I don't think we can be friends anymore, bro. I don't think we can be friends anymore. It's Balkan time. I don't know what that means. It sounds awesome. Balkan time. Spolt even saying it too. It's. <laughs> I, okay. Apparently it has meaning. Does anyone know what Balkan means? Prepare to fight. The world will never know. Map 4. Evil on match Three, point. Two, one, fight. He gets the red claws immediately over to Mega. Then going back for his LD. Well, they meet at rail here. It's very common timing for it to happen. Oh yeah, Evil almost going for that circle jump there. That could have been a first frag for Claus as Evil, if Evil jumps just a fraction of a second early. Oh yeah, the default announcer, Fadecore. Honestly, I don't mind the default announcer, it's just that everyone kept nagging me to put on Vadrigar. 
So I did. Just their gamma here it seemed a little little bright. Oh, I can't get around the corner. Brutal. <laughs> and here comes the opening DM6 pain drain, which varies similarly to, to almost all maps. When there's an explosion of frags one way, it can still happen the other. So far, Evil's only met, excuse me, only managed to find two. Vlad's looking like he's gonna commit this life and his yellow that he picked up towards just doing as much damage as possible to Evil. He's running away quite a bit of his red. Mega not incredibly useful, either. But, I mean, that's okay. It's gonna mean he doesn't have a 200-200 opponent bearing down on him. So. Sometimes you got sometimes you gotta disrespect your own life and just, just die. Resolutely. Hold your head up resolutely and just die. Is Claus gonna try to steal this red? That'd be so ballsy. Okay, I thought he was still on the side of the map for some reason. By the way, if you're wondering why Evil's not picking this up, he's just delaying it so he doesn't sync it up with the uh, Mega there on the left hand side. Makes it easier to get both items. First kill for him. You think it could <laughs> monetize voiceovers? What just happened? Welcome back to the game, Claus. It's good to have you again, sir. Let's go, Commander. Yeah, there's a lot of things that could have and could be done to monetize the game. Microtransaction wise, voiceovers being one of them. But who cares about voiceovers right now? Welcome back, Commander. Oh, back out, back out, back out. This has been this has been too wonderful for for you to blow this now, Claus. <laughs> Evil will opt out to win the armor war. He collected red, all the shards, and the yellow. Five minute. Uh, Claus is dead if he sticks around for this fight, unless he hits everything. No, the rockets are bad. Yeah, Claus had no armor whatsoever. It doesn't matter if you have a mega health. That's all going to get stripped away so fast. And weaponless up with this yellow? He's got the shotgun, but how much is that really gonna help you? Evil can't connect his shots? Oh, with anything but the floor. Oh, 
We are vast. We are fastly approaching a tied game again. After Claus took a four-point lead. I know. I didn't. I, that's why I was so quiet. That's why I was so quiet, Remy. I didn't start saying anything until Evil got the kills again, man. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. We'll switch back over to him. I'll shut up. I'll go make co here. You know what? Mad AFK strats. I'll go make coffee. I'll come back. Claus will be two two against Evil. Came back too early. So he's only got one frag down. Obviously here. He's gonna, yeah, he needs to do something crazy. It's a good start. Railing at an item that you really shouldn't be at. Ooh, brutal. Brutal direct from evil. Gonna close it out in the next minute here. The red's still in away from him for the first time in a while. But it pushes a lot of rockets into Claus's face. Good steal, good risk. Evil expecting it though, didn't push in. He's gonna make this last frag really hard to get pushed in for. Or these last two frags, excuse me. And that's GG. So that'll be three maps to one for Evil. He will go on.